No sign of the path safe house yet. Subterranean waterways beneath the temple. Perfect. That should give our operation cover from Imperial scanners. scramble to evacuate. <laughs> Easy now. See your Junda sent me. Master Junda, 
You use the force, you're Cal Kestis. It's time to go. The Empire's closing in. Yes. Which is why this must make it back to Master Junda. These contact codes cannot fall into the hands of the Empire. back in. Desert Ghost. Never learned that the path was here. Enemies up ahead. I'll get you! Oh, 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 oh
When I return to Dathomir, it is taxing. You okay? I am fine. Come on, let's get these coats to see her.
Ready, Cal? Ready. Sorry. Aerotech speeder bikes. Never got to ride one.
See her. I couldn't save Armias. But he gave his life for this. I'm sorry. I know you did your best, Cal. And the Empire? They did not track us. Hey, Scrapper. Glad you made it back in one piece. Master Kudova. Did you find a way across the abyss? No. But you may have, Cal. Boat and I were able to find some interesting data in the archives. Let's show them what we dug up. Centuries ago, the Republic established the colony on Kobo to study a stellar anomaly known as the Abyss. Santari Kree led the research team. That sea with them. Early attempts to navigate the Abyss ended in disaster. The Republic was on the verge of abandoning the project. And then guess who volunteers to fly in alone and discovers a planet on the other side? Dagon. Using the data from his voyage, Kree invented the Abyss Compass to guide others safely to Tannel. The Republic established a settlement, the Jedi built a temple, just like you said, Cal. Regrettably, a time of peace and prosperity was disrupted when Outer Rim Marauders invaded. I saw them too, but how'd they get across the Abyss? They must have stolen a compass. Don't worry, we won't be so careless. Overwhelmed, the Republic abandoned Tantalor, and the Jedi Council ordered Creed to destroy the compass. Dagangera refused and rebelled against the Order. That is a Gendai. They do not often ally with other species. Looks like Ravis has been working with Dagon for a lot longer than we thought. So the Order sent Jedi to secure the compasses. Dagon murders them over it. Jedi killing other Jedi. But Centauri said that Dagon was the key to Tantalor. Maybe he is young Jedi. Despite my efforts, those compasses you brought me were beyond repair. However, records indicate that three were unaccounted for. So you're saying one might still be out there? Yes, and Dagon sent his army to look for it. <laughs> I'd ask you to stay and help us, but I recognize that look. Well, look. Hope. That planet could be a haven for those who stand against the Empire. So you're coming with us? I mean, Grease can make room on the Mantis. For all of you. No. This place needs me. The Hidden Path needs me. Cordova? I'm sorry, my friend. But for now, my place is on Jeddah with Seer. Let me prepare a data stick so you'll have access to our research wherever your journey takes you. Let me guess. You're staying too. When we first met, I thought that what we shared was... unique. Survivors. Fighting together against the Empire who took our families. Yeah. You helped me realize I wasn't alone. As did you. But there is a galaxy full of people who have suffered as we have. It's as Seer said. Perhaps you have found a sanctuary for them. Perhaps. If we can get to it. I will join you. Besides, it's been far too long since I've made Grease's hair stand on end. See you back on the Mantis night, sister. I suppose you have both studied Oisin's lemma. Yes, sister. Indeed, sister. Then perhaps you will explain to me the paradox of the future. Oisin explores the antinomy of enlightenment. It's a paradox about the inevitability of cycles. Hmm. Explain. Enlightenment is defined as cycle breaking. But, per the canons, to be enlightened is to suffer the cycle. 
The more we strive to make this happen, the more we accept it. Let's move, BD. There you are. Man, this is tuned to perfection and ready to go. <laughs> so where are we going? Back to Kobo. Turns out we need a special compass to navigate the... A compass? Okay, sure, sure. Whatever you say, kid. Oh, and... Marin's coming along. Wait, what? Mar Marin's joining us? Why didn't you tell me? I could have cleaned up the place. Oh, this is just perfect. Go back to Coruscant. What's her next destination? has changed. Oh yeah, Cal and Boat, they ain't exactly the cleaning type. I cleaned this morning. Wait, did I? No, I didn't. That's all. Aaron, I didn't know you were coming. Maybe I'll pick up this gas station. Why'd you join back up anyway? Seer and I believe Tantalor could be a refuge that was persecuted by the Empire. Persecuted by the Empire, huh? Gotta get crowded. Time to land. Get up here. Welcome to Kobo. It was horrible! Did something happen? The raiders paid us another visit. Took a shine to that droid you found. See? They took her, Cal! Carried her right out! She's been droid-napped! My saloon better be okay, Turgle. I think you brought this down on us! I'm innocent, Mr. Grease! Promise! Dagon sent them. He's after Tantalor. There must be something more to Z than we realized. Something scrambled up in her memory banks. We had to rescue her. Once he gets what he wants, he'll scrap her for sure. It won't be easy to get her back. The raider base is in the swamp. They gutted an old Luker Hulk battleship from the Clone Wars. We've seen it. Means they got a lot of firepower. As do we. She's right. Now's our time to move. I like where this is going. They already have what they came for. They're back at the fortress feeling safe, complacent. They'll never see it coming. Maybe not. But if you're wrong, then they'll be looking for payback. Not to worry. I will stay here and look after Grease and the others. You sure? I think you two can manage. Just don't let him swim without supervision. Let me know if you need help. My nice sex. Name's Mosey. Marin. All right. I'll scout ahead. Meet you there.
just won't open. One open. Jedi had to wander into my. 
There it is. Got your mark, I'm coming in. You made it. Anyone spot you? Me? <laughs> Not a chance. What are we dealing with? Any sign of the droid? Some kind of service gantry. Could be a way in. It's the best option I can see. Only way to the Lucre Hulk is through this swamp. For you, maybe. You want to ride, BD? <laughs> when you're ready, make a move on that gantry. I'll be watching. Copy that. That's one way not to get mud on your boots, huh? Now we just need to rescue Z. Hard to believe anything could live in this swamp. I guess our friend here makes it work. See that building, buddy? Guess someone does live here. Or did once. Off we go.
much do you think this is worth? Nothing's worth crossing the raiders. Now move. Check this place out. Absolutely not. My entire life is on that datapad. Cal, what are you doing out here? I could ask you the same question, Zig. I came out here to look for Z. Yeah, me too. Ahem, and I am Winnie Eres. Cal, was it? We've only just met, but I could use some assistance. What do you need? I was told there's a bird in this swamp that spots a resplendent plumage. But when I tried to get a closer look at one, it snatched my datapad and flew away. Where'd it go? They've got a nest at the top of a spire nearby. I'd go, but Winnie here says I gotta stay by her side. Yes! Yes, that spire there. It's so close, yet so far. I'll see what I can do. You shine like the stars. Oh. <laughs> That's a Coruscant saying, perhaps a more simple. Thank you, Carl. I can't move that, but there's no other way up to the pillar either. <laughs> 